Hey, hi, hello, back with new to the Sampath. You are watching Sampath Samfix YouTube channel, and this is Xiaomi Mi 11X or the Poco F3 or the Redmi K40 custom ROM reviews. Back with another video, guys. This is you can see based on HyperOS. This is a Paper OS version 3.0 based on 1.0.1.0 UNRC and XM Stable Edition powered by Raven UI project. Here you can see the necessary specifications here if i go into detailed information and specifications you can see the version again it's based on 1.0.1.0 hyper OS. this is a paper os 3.0 guys and android version is 14 here which is latest available as of now on kernel user 4.19.30 it real king kernel has been used this of the rom and i am using this extra 6 gb of virtual ram that will be showing very soon this how settings panel looks like and there are some animation implied here and this is a home screen and typical app drawer you get if i press and hold here you will get that theme support and you get all these options here will it get download for some reason moon wallpaper is given here and one more thing they have specified here not to use the always on display in this particular room check out description guys for more information and you get all the necessary wallpapers and you also get some extra wallpapers pre-installed here and also widgets you will get as you can see it will be categorized and you can even discover them and into settings you get all these effects here but i haven't found any solution to get back these names of the applications even in the home screen as well as in the app drawer i don't know maybe if you found that let me know in the comment section i'll pin that comment others will notify and utilize that and these all the apps i'm using and some of the apps are pre-installed here like this one the wallpapers you guys can see there are some wallpapers pre-installed like this and this is one more thing the music player is pre-installed here and apart from that gallery will be showing you within a while regarding that let me show that uh, the results later i will be showing the recognized text table create pdf protective watermark necessary things are given here and camera application you get a proper leica integrated if i go here as you can see hyper res camera this is all necessary features are available in the video mode you got only 4k 60 there is no six sorry 30 fs there is no 60 option here and if i go into more you get all these options it will get downloaded once you click on that this is the camera application and some of the apps pre-installed here also you get this me canvas as you can see you will utilize that once you use this wrong you will coming to know that and this is how the quick settings panel which resembles very similar to uh, iphone ios 17 here which is very similar to that even here edit section there are some options like lock screen and sync location vibration and automatic brightness tall brightness and all if you want you can drag and add them i will disable this one vibration and location here yeah what i found is the display is a little bit dimmer compared to uh, other versions of hyper os rom so what i use even if it is in max and even sunlight mode is turned on the display brightness is a little bit dimmer in this particular rom this are the quick settings panel guys we'll see some results what i got here with geekbench 6.2.2 version i got 1271 as the single score 3267 is the multi-score and again Linux 4.19.308 Real King version 15.4 Beast kernel has been used and this is the Geekbench version 10.2.4 I have used and this is in a balanced mode 8,60,917 is the score what I got 3 percentage of sorry 3 degrees Celsius of uh, temperature has been raised and 5 percentage of battery has been dropped during this entire testing which is quite good in my opinion and the base, basic integrity and cities profile match both getting passed in safety net attestation here even the device is getting certified hence you can use all the payment applications like google pay phone pay whatever you want to use you can use that and this is the drm information you get hdr 10 10 plus hlg support here and level 1 certified watching OTT applications in high definition resolution is not a problem here and this is the read rate speed test with graphical and numerical interpretation and this is the speed what i am getting i don't know my Wi-Fi plan is just 200 MPS. I am getting around 370 MPS. It's massive. Again, this uh, turbo charge support is available in this particular ROM. Let's move into settings here. Uh, from here, is there any? Yeah, is there. And this is how settings looks like. Very much uh, organized here. And paper OS modifications, you will get like this here. Okay, let's see. Uh, Remy Lab here. 
yeah in the control center you can actually adjust some of the things here expand media mode control center clock style control center style also you can change let's check this out style one nothing i have seen now let's keep style five and control center style system where restart is required to apply this well do one thing i will reboot this one and you also get advanced restart button and if a first time to this channel hit that subscribe button down below guys and also allow the bell notification once i release the video you'll be get notified very soon and also i recommend to join you the whatsapp group for this me 11x there is a dedicated whatsapp group available for me 11x or the poco f30 redmi k40 i recommend you to join the group and also uh, if you like this video give it a like guys because i'll be motivated to make similar kind of videos it's take a lot of time and effort to make this videos guys just making video is not easy here uh, this is a power bank xiaomi hyper os you guys can check out here this is the logo what we can get and once i restarted we'll check the quick settings toggle style is that a change up yeah nothing change i have seen here uh, but they have mentioned anyhow we'll check that out here in the paper os modifications again uh, in the remi lab i was in the control center and style was fine no change height smart hub is given control center cards you can actually do it out white monet let's make monet at least that will change here yeah and monet and volume bar again this how it looks like if i disable that how it looks like yeah it's not changing any of the things here enable super volume if you want you can enable that 200 percent here nothing has been shown anyhow these are the things they have given but it's still not working here in the themes customization again you get this kind of themes here important features like unlimited photo storage is available games like high fps i'll show you with well this is also not going to work in this particular room actually and uh, unimportant features it seems uh, side up and down default and the least here it was kept to default here these are all the animations you get extended power menu if want you can enable or disable from here uh, i think so they need to work it out in the upcoming build here again permissions you get these all things extra shortcuts here notification history is given and apply changes what option will be applying i don't know now also the quick settings toggles remains same here extra dim features are given here developer options here it's turned off if you want you can turn this on power button into the call if you want you can make them this is the credits version they have just released this but there's no modifications you will get here anyhow other settings remain very similar here like lock screen again it remains very similar more connectivity options like chromebook quick share printing cast dns vpn everything is working fine here even in the notification control panel you get notification shade and number of icons and again things looks very similar to any of the uh, similar hyper is custom rom here in the home screen again as i said there is no option to name the uh, apps in the home screen as well as in the app drawer here search bar provided is given and again guys minus one screen i kept google discover here it is app vault there are changes given but it is not active and not working double tap to lock screen and hide app icons again those are disabled and don't show text anywhere let's see still i didn't get any options here in the home screen or uh, off yeah desktop padding is given and recent apps here again system navigation gestures uh, animation speed and recent apps this is ios style that is working fine i really liked it but what things they need to add is additional settings again you get all the necessary options like memory extension up to 6 gb what i said at the early stage second space a floating windows tap plus front camera assistant everything remains same here and fingerprint face unlock and uh, app lock both all the three are given let me show you the fingerprint unlock first as you can see and face unlock yeah let's see bgma how it actually handles here nothing more to explain in the ui and settings
Now moving into BGM also. Again, I have enabled high FPS counter. Here we are getting just extreme, no extreme plus. That's what the things have been given, but those are not coming into action here. Uh, they need to rethink or re-upload the ROM with proper working here. But even though if it is working also, this ROM is no surprise here. It's very basic ROM, I can say. It's kind of hyper OS experience here. Apart from that, nothing is there. At least the gaming experience is fine here. That is good here according to 60 FPS and also you get this gaming mode. Let me enable this into performance mode. Let's see will it get any huge change or anything like that. Even in the counter attacks there is no lag. That is a good sign for gaming it's good. I'll come back here. This is the gaming experience. Gaming experience was really, really good, but uh, the UI is not that. I mean, it's not laggy or anything like that, but we have many options MMET, MA version, and other versions. Where many videos are available. You can check out in my channel. I don't think so. It's recommended here, but still, if you want to try, you can try it out. This is a paper OS 3.0 based on Hyper OS guys. Uh, this is Sampath signing off. If you have any specific questions regarding this particular room, let me know in the comment section. Uh, we'll meet you with another interesting video. Under that, keep smiling. Bye bye. bye.